Right. So this is how you remove these seats. And I'll end up discovering a seven seater too. So as you can see, I've got one removed there. And I'm just gonna remove this one. Obviously, they fold up. You've got these covers. I've never done with them. You've got this one that is on there. And then you've got the cup holder. They just pop straight off. And then you mix with a big spring. Just prop the seat up out of the way. And you're left with a spring there with four bolts. The bolts are 13 mil. Um, I'm using an impact gun. You can use a ratchet, whichever you want. Undo them four. Bear in mind, this is under tension. So when you undo these, keep your hands out of the way so they don't spin round and uh, take your hands off. Um, these are normal bolts. The other ones underneath are just nuts. So you've still got the thread, will be still there. I recommend undoing the bottom first, trying to prise the bottom away a little bit before doing a top. If not, you'll get stuck on the threads and you've got to jiggle it and mess about with it. Uh, so, let's see if I can uh, record this and do it at the same time. I'll just prop the seat up. So, get it on. See, that's all they are. This is probably not going to work, but we'll we'll see how it goes. Try this from a different uh, angle. There we go, that seems to be alright. Right. So, that's on the top, there on the bottom. Put you down a sec. Right. So I've got one out, let's quickly get this other one out. Right, I'm just propping this up, but as you can see, it's come away, but it's stuck on the bottom threads. I'm guessing there's no other way around it, but if you just use a pry bar, watch your head and everything. There we go. That's one off. You mean by these are under tension. So obviously that one's still attached. This should be all the way up, but it's under tension, so just be careful. Because you've got one off, you should be able to just remove that. You might be able to get a problem.
said, you can get stuck on the bottom threads. <sighs> Just there, you're stuck on thread because it's trying to push itself against it. So, if you can, see if I can rest that. If you can, try get the seat up as straight as possible. And just try and wiggle it about until it comes off at half wood. Really. You might find it easier if you come from this side and rest against the seat, push it up flat. And just give it a couple of wiggles at the same time. There you go, you can see it's removed. Bear in mind, big spring, these are under tension. Put it back in, obviously a bit the same way it came out. Try and get the bottom one on first, either side. See if you can get nut on it, just to hold them there. And then try and get something to tension the top into place it's aligned. Get the bolt in. And there you go. I looked online um, on how to take receipts out, and I haven't really found anything. Uh, a little bit of reading um, telling you how to do it, but there's no videos that I can see of anyway. So, if you want to remove these seats, then uh, that's how you do it. Bit fiddly, but you'll get there.